Hey there friends, welcome to another Tech Talk tutorial video. Today we're going to be resetting this Netgear Nighthawk router to the factory default settings. It's a really easy process. You're basically going to need a paper clip or a SIM card key, which I'm using here, and your router. Let's get started. Okay, now with your Netgear router plugged in, you're going to be looking basically on the back of this guy here and with the, the power on. Again, the power switch is over here right next to your power cord. And I do have that in the on configuration. You're going to find the reset button all the way over here next to your Ethernet ports. And you can see it says a little reset underneath there. And there's a little slot where our SIM card uh, key or a paper clip or again a pen, anything that can get into side that, uh, that little dot there. Uh, can be can be used. So what we're going to be doing is we're actually going to again restore to default settings. Remember that when you do this, all of your settings, your password, your login information is going to be reset back to that factory default setting. If you've lost the factory default settings, you can look on the bottom of your router, and you can see that sticker there is going to have all of your default information for this specific router, so that you can retrieve and and get on there and reset the settings if need be. Okay, now basically all we're gonna do is take that pin, I'm gonna stick it inside the slot, and we're gonna hold that button down for seven seconds. That's about three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, as you can see, the lights are all on, it's recycling, going through the reset process. This can take up to a minute or so, and once all your lights have come on again, you basically are at the default settings. So that's, it's as simple as that. And uh, at this point you can log back in uh, to your software interface and reconfigure this with another password or uh, administrator account. Friends, I hope that's helped. If it has, will you hit that thumbs up button and uh, hit subscribe. We got a lot more tutorial videos on tech that's coming up really, really soon. Thanks so much for watching.